I am Chalfant and this is Chalfant TV. What's up everybody, I'm Chalfant and welcome to Chalfant TV. Go ahead and crush that like button for this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on those notifications so that you're updated when new videos come out. Today I'm gonna to be reacting to BTS's performance, Dear Class of 2020. I'm not sure what songs they're gonna be performing, but I'm excited to see it because it's been on the list for a while. So let's go ahead and get into it. So it's the same location as the speech itself. I love the live performance of this. I love that part too, where the light and the camera comes above. I love the color of their suits. I love this part of the live performance too where they're all circling Suga. Look how tall Tay is. <laughs> I was waiting for him to go. I love that dance. The rose. Love yourself. Wow. I wonder if J-Hope's gonna sing this time like he did in a Tiny Desk concert. Show off those vocals. I 
Tay is always looking fly. Anybody else look at Suga at least watching this video right now and think of either the hologram or like, oh, Suga's back. I love that they're actually at this museum and then it's the same place that they gave the speech. In this part of the museum it looks like it's like a walkout into the outside and it's nighttime. Hopefully it's real. Why is so funny? More tattoos I didn't know about. I stay looking at him like that. What's next? I don't know this song yet. Yeah. 
二人。Thinking about how they're dressing now and wondering or remembering that this is actually a performance for the class of 2020 and now it almost feels like they're dressed as students or young adults. Such a great voice. Unexpected. You could tell they performed this a few times. So that may be the first and only graduating class that had BTS perform at their graduation. But like they said in the speech, you know, this is the largest graduating class ever based on their commencement speech. I think it's interesting and also cool that they're able to use Spring Day and insert that into many contexts just because it has so many different meanings and whatever meaning we have and we attach it to that song, it works well, both with uh, the things going on when they perform the Tiny Desk concert and then this as well. And I think it's just a song of hope. While there are many theories, I think, around the meaning of Spring Day itself, especially the music video, I think it's really just about hope and it's just a great message to give those graduating high school in this time of uncertainty for sure. And I really like performances like this. You could see Tay was super playful, J-Hope is always smiling, Jin is always doing something and like you have to see him out of the back of the screen to actually know and just overall it was a good performance and I'm glad that I watched it so thanks for recommending it. It had been on my list from the very beginning once I had found out they had a commencement speech and then a graduation performance. So if you're still here with me go ahead and crush that like button for this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on those notifications so that you're alerted to when new videos come out. Thanks for joining me. I am Shalfont and this is Shalfont TV and as Jimin says, you nice, keep going.